Good day, everyone. Welcome, most especially to the teachers and aspiring teachers who are watching this video at this very moment. Last time, I showed you the remedial instruction that could help us correct sight word knowledge deficit, and I hope we all learn from it. Now let us talk about one of the skills from phonemic awareness, which is sound blending. What is sound blending? Sound blending is an example of phonemic awareness skills. It is the ability to build words from individual sounds by blending sounds together in sequence. We use this to help our students familiarize themselves with the sounds for each of the letters. Also, this is to help them blend the sounds together to determine the word. Allow me to show you an instruction for sound blending. This is the overview of the instruction. All right, now let me show you a simple demonstration as an overview of the shown instruction. What we're going to do here is we will make the sounds and let, the, let our students think of the word. Let's have some practice. For the first sound, the sound is Again, the second sound is ah. Again, ah. Then let's combine the first and second sound. K plus a uh, k. Okay, and then for the third sound, t. Again, t. Now k, a. Uh, T. Did you hear a word? K, a, uh, t. Well, if you thought the word is cat, then you are correct. <laughs> now let's continue. For the first sound, we have b, b, a, b, a, b, b. The third sound is g. G, b, a, g, b, a, g. The answer is bag, bag. All right, let's continue. The first sound here is p, p. The second sound is e, e. Let's combine the first and second sound. P, p. And then for the last sound, mm, mm. all together, p, a, mm. p, a, mm. Did you hear a word? Correct. That's pen. Now we see phonemic awareness is the ability to hear and manipulate sounds in spoken word and at the same time understanding the that spoken words and syllables are made up of sequences speech sounds without it phonics makes little sense and that's one of the reasons why it is essential to learning to read an alphabetic writing system because letters represent sound now sound blending practices could help us help our students acquire such but much to its potential to remediate there are still challenges for us teachers and some of these are the followings Although there are 26 letters in the English language, there are approximately 40 phonemes or sound units in the English language. Note that the number of phonemes varies across sources. Second, sounds are represented in 250 different spellings. Like for example, F, the sound F. As on spelling, it could be it could be PH, there are F, GH, and FF, like uh, Philippines. Fan, enough, gh. The sound unit's phonemes are not inherently obvious and must be taught. The sounds that make up words are co-articulated. That is, they are not distinctly separate from each other. And that ends the discussion for today. Again, this has been Gabriel Hinata. And I hope you learn a thing or two from our discussion. Until next time.